Go everyone, welcome back. Today I'm sitting here at the AMCO workshop and I'm running the little TL2 CNC lathe from Haas. So what I'm working on here today, I'm working on all these steam pipes. Now these are gonna be uh, welded by the fabrication students and it's for training and education or vocational education. So we do a quick face and then do this chamfer. And then when the students get a hold of it, it's up to them to adjust the root face for doing their welding. And once welded, these will be pressure tested. Uh, at the moment, you can see I've only done one side. Over here is the completed. So this is my completed section here where they're both done. Now I've got all these to do. And then I've got all those to do in that other bucket. Now today, we're just running this. Uh, I didn't program this conversationally. I programmed this using uh, good old fashioned Confusion 360 or Fusion 360, I'm just joking. And just running a basic cycle in here. Cycle time's about 30 seconds, I think. I stand corrected, 37 seconds is the cycle time. So let's have a look at this in action. So the door will shut. Now, I've got some optional stops set up in here, and Fusion does this in the post, so it warns you to change the tool. So it's roughly about four presses of the button, then you're up and away. We've got the spindle speed here at about 400 RPM, and I'm running 0.3 per rev. You see, I've just missed that because some of these sizes all vary, and now we're coming in from the chamfer. We're doing a reverse chamfer and just tr trying to eliminate the burr that I put on the inside of the part. You can see here. Nice little clean up. And I'm just homing the X upon finishing the cycle, not homing the, the Z. And you can see it come up really nice. And this is what the TL2 does really well at. So chucking sort of work like this, uh, it's not high production, it's low volume production. This machine here, it came with a chip conveyor as well, which is really handy to get those chips out of there and get them into the swarf bin. Um, got some really cool machines here. There's no students here today. They start back tomorrow. It's been uh, winter vacation here for them running hang surface coolant this machine here is a I believe yeah 20 branded uh, what's that November 2021 we received it June 22 she's a nice little piece of kit does uh, really good work and this is much faster setting it up in this one than doing it in the ST20 just a bit more easier access alrighty Thanks for watching, guys.